The Four Steps to God. Step one, God loves you and has a plan for you. The Bible says, God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son, that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Jesus said, I came that they may have life and have it abundantly. A complete life full of purpose. John 10.10 10. But here's the problem. Step 2. Man is sinful and separated from God. We have all done, thought, or said bad things, which the Bible calls sin. The Bible says, All have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. The result of sin is death, spiritual separation from God. Romans 6.23 The good news? Step 3. God sent His Son to die for your sins. Jesus died in our place, so we could have a relationship with God and be with Him forever. God demonstrates His own love toward us, and that while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us, Romans 5.8. But it didn't end with His death on the cross. He rose again and still lives. Christ died for our sins. He was buried. He was raised on the third day according to the scriptures. Jesus is the only way to God. Jesus said, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father but through me. John 14, 6. Step 4. Would you like to receive God's forgiveness? We can't earn salvation. We are saved by God's grace when we have faith in His Son, Jesus Christ. All you have to do is believe you are a sinner. That Christ died for your sins. And ask His forgiveness. Then turn from your sins. That's called repentance. Jesus Christ knows you and loves you. What matters to Him is the attitude of your heart, your honesty. We suggest praying the following prayer to accept Christ as your Savior. Dear Lord Jesus, I know I am a sinner and I ask for your forgiveness. I believe you died for my sins and rose from the dead. I trust and follow you as my Lord and Savior. Guide my life and help me to do your will. In your name, amen. Welcome to the forever family of Jesus Christ.